One more race in Paris, one more world record. Is it a love story between you and this city? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm still surprised as well. You know, last year I ran 5,000 and I got the world record and today I gave a world record. So, yeah, it's a special place, I can say. You know, coming here every time and breaking your own world, your record, it's, uh, it's just amazing. You know, breaking my own record in 1500 was just fantastic. And I've seen myself uh, like I'm in the right direction towards Paris Olympics. Uh, was today's race uh, according to the plan you made? Yeah, absolutely, yes. This was uh, my plan to see how fast I can execute today and see how I am, how prepared I am to, towards Paris because it's a few weeks ahead and uh, I've seen I'm in a good direction now, probably. Were you surprised to be followed by Jessica for a long, long time? Uh, no, I knew Jessica was capable of because, you know, she has been breaking her area a record in, uh, she ran beautiful race in Prefontaine and I knew, yeah, maybe today she's going to follow me or other athletes. Yeah, records are there to be broken. So I was like, yeah, somebody is behind me and yeah, we will push each other towards, uh, towards the world record or season best. What's your schedule now until the Olympics in three weeks? Yeah, just to go back home and just still work on uh, uh, a little bit of tactics and then uh, or I don't know what coach is going to tell me to do and uh, come back for uh, Olympics. I think uh, my bigger call now is just Olympics. So you'll be back for the Olympics, but will you be back next year for the meeting of Paris? Absolutely, yes. I'm uh, really, really in love with Paris and I hope next year I will be back again. Thank yes, thank you. Thank you.